French aircraft manufacturer Dassault Aviation has achieved a new feat by delivering the first Rafale fighter jet upgraded to the F-4.1 standard to the French Air Force. The French Ministry of the Armed Forces made the announcement on March 3rd. The ministry said the first Rafale F-4 was delivered to the French Air Warfare Center CAM, at the mont de -Marsan Air Base near Bordeaux on March 2, 2023. In a statement, Lieutenant Colonel Guillaume, second in command of the Fighter and Experimentation Squadron, ECE, stated, The first plane we received today is one of the F-3RS that we sent to the Flight Test Center of the General Directorate of Armaments in Istras for their software transformation. The latest F-4 upgrade for the Rafale, which the French Military Procurement Agency Direction Générale de l'Armement DGA, plans to have fully operational by 2025, started flight tests in April 2021. The operational entry into service of the F-3R standard was signed in March 2021 by the French Air and Space Army and the French Navy. Guillaume further highlighted that other brand new aircraft would be received directly from the Dassault manufacturing facilities and would complete the fleet of fighters gradually transferred to Istras to upgrade from the F-3R standard to the F-4.1. On January 14, 2019, Florence Parley, then Minister of the Armed Forces, appointed Dassault Aviation to develop the fresh F-4 standard for the Rafale. The value of the contract was put at 2 billion euros. The F-4 standard is projected to link the Rafale and France's next-generation fighter aircraft, which is being developed as part of the Trinational Future Combat Air System FCAS, program. Under the program, France, Germany, and Spain are collaborating to develop a new fighter jet that will be operational by 2040, along with a slew of cutting-edge capabilities. The fleets of Rafale's and Eurofighter Typhoons of the partnered nations would be replaced with the next-generation fighter. In December 2022, industry partners Dassault, Airbus Defense and Space, and Indra Systems stated that they had agreed to move to the next phase in the FGAS research and development work. Preparing the Rafale for the sixth generation of fighter jets. With the delivery of the first Rafale 4.1 to the French Air Force and a second aircraft expected a week later, testing will continue at the CEAM. The target is now to induct the standard with the 30th fighter wing to start training before pronouncing its initial operational capability, IOC. The F-4 standard focuses on improving the connectivity of the Rafale with other systems through new satellite and intra-patrol links, communication server, and software radio. Thus, the fighter will be able to integrate into the future combat air system being conjointly developed by France, Germany, and Spain. A helmet-mounted site with augmented reality and a Talios targeting long-range identification optronic system, POD, both manufactured by the French company Thales, were integrated to boost the fighting capability. Several improvements to the fighting capability were also developed, with the integration of a helmet-mounted site featuring augmented reality and a Talios targeting long-range identification optronic system, POD, both developed by the French manufacturer Thales. The Rafale F-4 will also be able to drop one-ton precision-guided bombs, ASM-1000 hammer. This massive improvement of the backbone of the French Air Force is one of the needed evolutions to extend its operational life and prepare its operation alongside the FCAS. Rafale's F-4 Upgrade the first phase will start with the delivery of the first Rafale of F4.1 standard, which will see the induction of the aircraft. The goal is to induct the aircraft so that the 30th fighter wing pilots can use the plane as soon as feasible. This stage is vital to enabling the military to use the Rafale F4.1 for training missions initially. The next step will be to approve the Rafale F4's first operational capability, PCO, later, Full operational commissioning will follow. Moreover, 
The Rafale F4 can drop precision-guided AASM-1000 hammer bombs that weigh one ton. This enormous upgrade to its core capabilities is one of the required evolutions to increase the French Air Force's operational life and prepare it to operate alongside the FCAS. Meanwhile, it was reported that France would purchase 42 Dassault Rafale fighters in 2023 to fill the capacity deficit caused by selling 24 used aircraft to Greece and Croatia. In 2020, according to a goal set by then Defense Minister Florence Parley, the French Air Force's mainstay Rafale fighter jets will increase from 102 to 129 by 2025. The fighter jet's recent commercial success threw this plan off course. In response to rising territorial concerns with Turkey, Greece ordered 18 Rafale F-3R fighters for the Hellenic Air Force in January 2021. Twelve aircraft were taken from the French Air Force's inventory to expedite delivery. One month later, 12 Rafales were ordered to replace the used planes. In May 2021, Croatia announced the purchase of 12 pre-owned French F-3R Rafale fighter aircraft to upgrade the nation's air force. That said, those 42 new aircraft will most probably be supplied in the F-4 standard. <laughs>